Hi. I'm Dennis. We got a fresh six inches of snow the other day. And it basically took about ten minutes to clean up all of the snow around the house, down the driveway, push it all across the road with my plow car. It's an old 2006 Nissan Sentra that uh, I took off the road and found that under the front of the car there were hook holes to hold these cars in transport. I'm going to try to show you how it all works. You can see the bolt up in here. There's one on each side that holds the frame of the plow, which was constructed by some old angle irons and plates I had hanging around the house. Anyway, this is what's left of an old wheel horse plow. The very last two foot of it welded to an angle. Two. One bolt holds the plow, the bottom of the plow is half inch thick rubber, cow mat, cut, drill holes and bolts and an angle that holds it in place. So the steel basically never touches the ground, only the heavy rubber, which acts like a kind of like a broom, as you can see, cleans it right just about to the dirt. You can't beat that. Not only does the frame fit on the Nissan, which it was built for, it also fits on my fairly new Subaru. I've had the plow on it once, just to check it out. And it works without having to make a hole in the hood to hold the uh, pipe that holds the plow, the winch. These cars come with a ring that's sc screwed into the bumper of the car. I cut a coupling in two welded it on both sides of the ring and insert the pipe that holds the winch. Like I said, these cars come with these hook holes for in transport that are perfect for a small plow. The dimensions are exactly like the Nissan. Two bolts, the bracket goes right on. The winch, of course, sits on top of the pipe. Just the pipe goes in here with the flat plate that holds the winch. The cord goes into the car and connects to the battery. And there you have it. Even though it's off center, it still picks the plow up perfectly flat because the two bolts under the car are, are so spread out that the plow comes straight up even though the pipe is offset. Anyway, there you have it. Now you can build one for yourself.